Well, children living in South Australia's most isolated communities have been handed a unique access all areas pass to Adelaide Zoo. But unlike city kids, they won't have to leave home to take a walk on the wild side. It's an experience kids living in remote South Australia rarely get. An up close and personal encounter with some of Adelaide's most cuddly and not so cuddly residents. But now technology is bringing the zoo to them. Just like you guys, this animal's still quite young. Homeschooled kids logging on today to meet zookeepers and the animals they take care of. For me as a child, being able to get up close to nature was something that I dreamed to do as a career. So to be able to provide that opportunity back to children, um, yeah, it, it's just a very rewarding job every day. Jody Keogh lives on a station in the far north, her son Jacob taking part in today's lesson. When he first saw the real live animals, wow, he said, and um, he especially liked the snake. Teacher Kimberly Brown says the lesson got the attention of students. So they're sitting forward, so that's a good sign when they're on the webcam. Um, and all those kids, they seem to have a really love for animals. Today also marks National Threatened Species Day, giving staff at the zoo the chance to educate youngsters on the importance of protecting natives like this little guy. His name's Otis and he's a bilby and his species is endangered. It is these children who are going to be the future ecologists of Australia, so to be able to provide that link to them, um, yeah, I feel really lucky to be able to do that. Brett Burney, Nine News.